Welcome to Scare Tales. Today's story is from Art Bell Ghost to Ghost. George from California, and the story is Chief of Police. I moved into an apartment and it was a duplex. I had a young couple move in next door to me. At the time, I was 21. I was kind of scared because I didn't know the area or anything like that. I went next door to meet my new neighbors, and while I was sitting on the couch, I heard things falling at my house, and I couldn't understand what was going on. I was sure it was back at my house because in the duplex, our kitchens were wall to wall. So I got up and went back to see what was going on, and things were coming out of my kitchen cupboards. They were literally coming out of my cupboards. Then I stopped at my place and started picking up things to put them back on the shelves. My neighbor came over and was helping me, and it started at her house. It was getting to us, so for quite a while we spent our days during the daytime together because it had really gotten scary. One night when I was sleeping, I got shook wide awake, and I was told, get up now and come over here, and I couldn't understand what was going on. I knew I was the only one in the house, and I thought this is crazy, and I turned the light on, and I looked at the wall, and there was a man standing there. And I thought, who are you? And he said, come here. And I walked over to him, and all of a sudden, he just disappeared. It was kind of weird for me because I felt literally scared to death. Yet I knew he wanted me to do something. I kept seeing myself in this mirror, and then all of a sudden, I could see his face. And I thought, this is not right. I pounded on my neighbor's wall, and she and her husband came over, and I moved the mirror. There was a room behind the wall, and there were all of these guns and knives and bows and arrows, Confederate money, flags hanging all over the walls. I was just kind of freaking out at this point, going, what is this? This was not right. And there were gun cleaning kits. I just couldn't believe all this stuff. The next thing I know, I called the police. Of all the odd things to do, I know. I called the police and the police came to the house and they said to me, Do you know who lived here? And I said, No. They said the old chief of police died there. I said, You've got to be kidding me. They said, No. All the stuff belonged to him. And I told them what he looked like. And they said, Are you joking with us? And I said, No. This is what I saw. And after that happened, after they took the guns and knives out of the house, everything stopped. It completely stopped. The stuff stopped coming out of the cupboards. I couldn't handle it anymore. I had to get out. Subscribe for more stories.